Princess Charlene is in stable condition after suffering a medical emergency amid her ongoing health battle. The Princess of Monaco was taken to a South African hospital earlier this week after collapsing, according to the Princess Charlene of Monaco Foundation. The foundation told multiple outlets in a statement, Her Serene Highness Princess Charlene of Monaco was rushed to hospital by ambulance late Wednesday night. After collapsing due to complications from the severe ear, nose, and throat infection she contracted in May, the princess's medical team is currently evaluating her, but have confirmed that the princess is stable. The director of Charlene's foundation told Agence France Presse that the royal was released from the hospital on Friday morning, and that doctors, quote, are still establishing exactly what happened. Access Hollywood has reached out to the foundation for comment. Charlene's hospitalization comes as she continues her months-long battle against complications from the infection, which she developed after a sinus procedure, and left her unable to return to her home in Monaco. Last month, she underwent a four-hour major surgery, the latest in a series of corrective measures to alleviate the situation. Charlene's husband, Prince Albert, and their twins, Gabriella and Jacques, were able to visit her in South Africa last month as she continued her recovery. Following their trip, he had told People Magazine that his wife was ready to come home, saying, she's jokingly said that she's ready to stow away on a ship to come back to Europe. At the time, he said that her return date would depend on her doctor's recommendations, but guessed that it could be as early as this month. He said, I know she said possibly late October, but that was before this most recent round of appointments. I'm pretty sure we can cut that time frame a little short. Charlene has spoken out about the difficulties she's faced amid her health journey. She told South Africa's News 24 in July, It's been a trying time for me. I miss my husband and children dearly. What has been extremely difficult for me was when I was instructed by my medical team that I could not return home for my 10th wedding anniversary. Albert is my rock and strength, and without his love and support, I would not have been able to get through this painful time.